guys welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be DIY football team decor if you like this video make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you are new let's get on with the video the things you're gonna need is a wooden picture frame paint brushes paint paint pen ribbon and a hot glue gun so first we're gonna get started by painting the picture frame and you can paint it whatever your colors are for your team. And then I'm using a hairdryer to dry the frame in between the layers of paint. So now I'm using my paintbrush and white paint to paint on some polka dots. I have no rhyme or reason for this, I just painted them all over the place. We're using our paint pen to go ahead and write on the words for mine, since I'm an Arkansas Razorback fan. I'm writing the words hog wild, but write whatever words pertain to your team. Next, we're gonna make some bows for the top of our picture frame. And we're going to just use some ribbon or I'm just making sure that I get the right length. And we're going to cut out all these pieces of ribbon. It kind of was an experiment process. I was just cutting and gluing and seeing what worked. So pretty much do the same. Just play around with it until you figure out how you get your bow the way that you like it. There's a lot of hot glue used in this project as with most of my projects. So here I am gluing all of the pieces together and making it look the way that I wanted it to look. And then I'm taking this piece and wrapping it around the center just to make the bow look nice and finished. So now I'm just gluing the finished bow on the top of my picture frame and that's it. For this next DIY, you're going to need a large wooden letter, some small wooden letters, paint brushes, paint pens, paint, a pencil, and a hot glue gun. So you're gonna get started by painting this letter. I have painted so many times on here for you guys, you guys probably don't wanna see this anymore, but I'm just painting the whole frame black. And then I'm also painting these little letters white. And then I'm just starting to draw tusk onto my letter. So tusk, if you do not know, is the mascot for the Arkansas Razorbacks. Um, I freehanded this. You can use a template, you can trace, whatever you're comfortable with. And I am coloring in with Sharpie paint pens. I tried painting this on another version of this project and it just took so long. So I decided to just go the easy route. And now I'm using my black paint pen to go ahead and outline and make all the details. Using oil pens on top of oil paint pens, it can, can cause it to mess up. So that's why you see me constantly tapping the pen on the paper so that I can make sure the tip is saturated. And then I'm using my white pigment pen so that I can do, do the details. I just forgot to include that in the materials list. So now I'm putting my letters, my mini letters, I'm just placing them on there for spacing so that I make sure that I have enough room for my bow. And I'm not gonna show you guys how I did this bow just because I just did the other one, but if you want 
a tutorial on how to make different kinds of bows, let me know in the comments. So now I'm gluing my cute little football bow on the top of my letter. And then it's time to make sure that my little letters go on correctly. So here I'm just going ahead and hot gluing them all on there. And the last project here, I need some wood boards or canvas, some paint brushes, a pen, paint, ribbon, and a hot glue gun, and a paint pen. So you're gonna start by painting all of your little boards. I used white and red. You use whatever colors go with your team. And then I'm painting cute little black dots all over all of my boards. Just kind of similar in the same way that I did for the picture frame. And apparently I lost the footage of me writing the words on the boards, but it's the same way I've written things before. I just use my Sharpie paint pens. So now I'm just turning these over and making sure that they are spaced out correctly and I'm lining up my ribbon that's going to help me keep all of these little pieces together. And then I just hot glue that ribbon to each piece of the wood. And so now I'm cutting out the ribbon so I'm doing a different bow than I did before. Instead of tying and having all the loops and stuff together. And what I'm doing is I'm getting a piece of ribbon from each of the rolls that I had. I have to make the little loop for the top so that it can hang. And then, so I'm gonna tie all of these little pieces of ribbon together. So essentially it's just gonna look like they're just all dangling down together. Just so y'all know, I am watching the Razorback game as I am recording this voiceover. Pascal hates when I watch football. And that's it. That's all that you need for your little hanging wall decor. I really hope you guys liked this video. If you do decide to recreate any of these crafts, make sure that you tag me on Instagram if you put them up there. I am at Pascal Rose DIY. And like I said, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you have suggestions for other videos or if you, like I said, wanna see a bow tutorial, any kind of tutorials, just let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.